So for all the Dell users, it seems as if there comes a point in time where this thing, this guy, just does not want to charge your device anymore. He doesn't feel like it. Or the device doesn't like him anymore. Or her. Whatever. This thing is. Just doesn't like it. So you end up in a situation where you're watching videos on, hey, let me take apart my laptop and try to fix the charger port or maybe it's the battery or you're going to pay someone to do it. Best Buy takes like two, three weeks. Went to micro center. Um, uh, a bunch of things that you really don't want to do because you got to go back to your work, whatever it is that you do. So I was staring at it and I found a solution. All right, so I'm hoping you can see this. Okay, so on the top right here, this is for this, right? This is the charger adapter. So plug it in. Where is, no, 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 no. Let's, okay, let's pop this up. There we go. So you notice it's charging now, but for two days, it stopped charging. It just did not want to charge. Take away the flash. Okay, that's much better. <clears throat> so for two days, it didn't want to charge. It wasn't getting any battery. I don't know what happened. So I'm like, okay. Mm. Did a bunch of research. I got a bunch of videos saying, take apart my laptop, give it to Best Buy or Micro Center, make them fix it, all type of things that I did not want to do because I have a lot to do. So I was staring at the laptop and it hit me. It also comes with, let me turn on the flash. Boom, flash, hold on, magic. This guy right here, let me move my headphones on anyway so you can see it properly. Yeah, 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 there it is, there it is. Right there, that guy right there. Yeah, so the, what that is, that little slot right there in between my HDMI cord and my headphones jack is a Type-C slot. So it appears that Dell was like, I know, my charger isn't any good, so rather than just replacing the charger, I'll put a second slot. So, let me just take this out right now. Where's my Type C? Okay. If I put this, mind you, this is a a forty five watt, the one that comes from the Dell XPS. Took this from a friend of mine, because she has the XPS thirteen. <laughs> which uses less voltage but if you look now i'm back to charging but i just want to give a fun fact this is a 45 watt in order for your dell xps to work correctly 50 your dell xps 15 to work correctly you need to probably go to amazon or wherever you shop for your parts or your accessories and get a 130 watt charger. That's very important. Okay, perfect, see it popped up here. You see where it says this, this little, um, this little symbol right here, the caution sign, it says slow charging. And it's slow charging because the type C with 45 watts is not strong enough for your 15. It's only strong enough for the 13 XPS. <laughs> so you need to order a 130 watt charger in order for you to get the same quality charging that you did from your original charger. So don't take apart your laptop. Don't do any of that. Just go grab a type C. Keep on keeping on. All right. Thanks. All right, so the brand new one came in the mail, maybe about 12 o'clock today, Sunday. I was surprised, came next day from Amazon. So I just plugged it in, all right? As you can see, Dell 130 watt adapter, all right? The official one. Don't get one that doesn't have this type of information on it. If it doesn't have this type of information on it, it's probably not an authentic Dell charger. So make sure it has a Dell 130 watt adapter etc and all this other information at the bottom of it 
to make sure it's an authentic one because sometimes if you get one that's an off brand it might not work now if you look here i plugged it in as you can see in the c adapter well the c type adapter and perfect it's working perfectly no signs of error it's stabilized we're good to go